Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only, and welcome back to some more read along. So, all of Eris Melancholy's volumes have been released, so now we can actually go through all that, thanks to the whole update going through. As you can see, we have this little check mark that indicates that we have all of them. So now we can go through four and five. So, with all that said, let's get into it. We also have Legend also ready. So we can just go down the line now. I think all books are released, or maybe not all of them, but I'll just, you know, go through it and check and see. Volume 4, All That Glitters. The people in these photographs are also pretty. Vera exclaimed as she picked up Ike's box of framed photos. Of course they are. Otherwise, they wouldn't have had a chance to leave me with a photograph to remember them by. Ike had no intentions of avoiding. After all, he was a galactic sage. Who was over a thousand years old so of course he knew that girls were easily hurt and that they could become trouble very easily ike would thus never cheat a girl take notes boys having seen the starry host i thus make star shaped jewels to remember them by he continued to explain but those stars that shine across the universe do not belong to anyone, so it is also impossible to steal them. Fuhrer did not understand. What are you saying? I'm saying this for a foolish fellow who isn't present right now. Pay it no mind. Humans are just far too young. I will serve as a go-between between you and Ike, Sachi said to the princess of the Andromeda Empire in a loud voice. Huh? I love Vera. I don't. Disgusting. Boring. Be silent, worm. You are an offense to my ears. I've already acknowledged Vera as my friend. I will not hand over her to a cowardly person like you. What? what? The ending of that sentence is basically what I am about the story. Everything was, you know, added up. And now I'm just basically confused from now on. <laughs> but I kind of get it in a way, too. I guess, I guess it's mostly just because... How that ended off but i i kind of understand it just kind of throws you off when you don't know who's speaking from this point but i can definitely say this part wasn't needed really take notes boys that's that's really cringy <laughs> it, it just makes me think someone of the female category definitely wrote that part <laughs> Just wasn't necessary at all. It's just really cringe. Anywho, Volume 5. Volume 5, Roadside Picnic. When Ike was taking a nap, his servant waged a terrible war against each other. The great wizard had subdued many gods and demons to serve under him. As the most formidable wizard of his day, I was in a command of gods and demons more numerous than the entries in the dictionary. But who was the strongest of those under his rule? The gods and demons decided to find out for themselves through battle. Unfortunately, they seemed to have erroneously regarded as their own three who were neither god or demon, the princess Sachi and Vera. Ike only slept for two hours, but in that time, three stars had already been destroyed. Why should I protect you? The princess pulled her hand away, and the giant demon plummeted to the ground, its eyeballs gone. The dominant race of the Andromeda Empire may look lovely and sweet, but on their palms grow two special mouths, which they used to devour the eyeballs of their lovers and those they vanquish. Are we not friends? Vera wipes the blood off her face and appeared to be hurt by the princess's words. Yeah, yes. The princess blushed and looked away. I already regard you as my only friend. For what has happened? I was not referring to you, Vera. No, Sachi yelled as a gnarly jaws of a dragon closed around him. Do you surrender to me now? The giant dragon jeered. Surrender and concede that 
You are worthless, lowly rats, and I shall let you live. I surrender, I surrender, let me go, Sachi screamed. Why, a lizard of your despicable breed should know better than to utter such foolish words. Even the geckos in my palace could crush you. The princess gave her wrist a twist. No, this has nothing to do with me, Sachi yelled as the dragon cast him into the sky. And just like that, the battle between the dominant species of the Andromeda and the ancient giant dragon was over. The mortal, you won't get hurt if you just surrender. Sachi was knocked out of the contest and woke Ike up with a slap of a slipper. Vera also survived thanks to the protection of the princess. Arga, you imbecile. The mere sight of you is revolting. Do not come near me. Don't talk to me. Don't look at me. Nor breathe the same air as me, you lowly scum. The princess could not have a lower opinion of Sachi. Okay. So first things first, uh, I was I was following what was going on through like volume four until we got to volume five. You know, I know the whole war thing is going on, but I'm also confused at how we got into the whole battle and everything with Sachi and Vera. I whatever. Uh, but I'm trying to even follow what the hell's going on right now. But you know, if you guys want to um, make a shorter summary of wh where the fuck Volume Four and Five went during that whole section, <laughs> let me know. <laughs> and plus, to the person who wrote this, stop overdoing it with certain words. There are certain words in here that people don't use in everyday lives. First off. Like, we get it. You, you went to some fancy school to where you want to use words that nobody else uses in everyday life. It It's not even called for, really. There, there's easier ways to summarize, like, certain words, you know. I feel bad for any kid that's trying to read this and, you know, thinking he'll learn something. But no, he's going to spend up most of his time trying to look up fucking words of how... Uh, what What's this word? What's that word? What's this word? Yeah. Good luck, kid. <laughs> Like, I want to sit here and ask, who the hell uses erroneously in, like, any everyday, like, conversation? Really? Like, do you see me using that word in everyday life? Hell no. None of us would. If, if there's no point in using that word. <laughs> There's so many easier ways you could have just chose the words. I don't know, dude. I guess they just think they should just use big words just to sound advanced. It's not required. It's really not. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you. But anywho, hope you guys enjoyed Volume 4 and 5. I'll upload Volume 6 and 7 and we'll be even more confused through the journey. But, you know, hey, we're... I don't... Fuck it. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. Until then, peace out. Jesus.